Since no one's seen my videos, I figured I'd tell you all my political leanings. I'm just kidding, I wouldn't do that to you. But since I was a cop, you might find this interesting. The article starts out about legalizing pot on the federal level. Over 20 states have it legal now, but the federal government has it at Schedule 1. It's right there with heroin. It means it's super dangerous and has no medical value. That doesn't sound like any weed I've been around. Fentanyl, on the other hand, is a Schedule 2. We're up to what, 175 people under 45 dying every day from fentanyl poisoning? So we're already upside down, without even changing anything. Weed's been the devil since 1937. I'd like to propose we've changed a lot since 1937. And to be transparent, I use CBD and hemp products. I don't use weed, it's not my thing. So the article talks about them legalizing it. And then you read, they're not legalizing it at all. They're moving it down schedules, which that does help. But we're doing half measures to appease everybody, not doing what's right. They're talking about moving it to schedule three, steroids, which are in your body right now and a felony to possess, sell, or manufacture. Ketamine Schedule 3 as well. Valium and Xanax, abused way more, are Schedule 4. A cop, a pharmacist, and a doctor all need to sit down and have a discussion. In my opinion, prohibition's never worked, and they need to address why there's a demand. But anyway, yeah, Schedule 1 to Schedule 3, and it's not going to fix anything.